What's up guys, it's Leroy Jenkins here for another video, an update video. In this update video, guys, I'm going to be talking to you guys about the brand new police camera update and just a full a full on rework of the camera. So basically, guys, if I go ahead and uh oh, need to reset here, but basically, the camera is brand new kind of ish. It's kind of a combination of all the three now because before there was here. Let me let me just spawn the vehicle so that you can see. I spawn in the CVPI, right? Spawn in. And basically before there's, you know, the CAD, the flip, but there's actually a third option that said camera that let you switch between like the roof or like a, like a, what's a dash cam version, a overhead over the top version. And then like, you know, a regular third person. And then I think it was also a locked version where like it was only locked like this and you turn left. It basically stayed locked left if you turn right. Basically it just locked on the car. But now guys, it's all built in. But let me tell you, there is also another angle, a secret angle, guys. But the only way to figure out what that final camera angle was is to subscribe. Yep, yep, I gotta say it. I got to say it. Guys, if you are new here, I want you to do two things. After you finish watching this video, check out two other videos. And if you like them, subscribe. Simple as that. I'm not gonna say, if this is your first video, do not subscribe if it's your first video. I want you to look at two other videos I've uploaded in the past month. If you like them, then subscribe. That's all you got to do. Just check them out. Give me a chance. And guys, if this is your third video or your second video you're watching, then subscribe because you already know that you guys like it. So uh, without further ado, let me show you guys now what this camera update is all about. It basically means you have one big camera angle. But look, guys, here's like the roof angle. And then you zoom in. Bam. Just instantly. You're able to go from here to zoom all the way in to first person mode guys and look at this guys i should do a whole interior review for all the cars because my goodness i could get into some really detailed stuff but because this is an update video and i have to show it off on all the teams i am gonna be uh going off to the next team which is the fbi team because this was actually the, the first time that i noticed it because as you guys know since there was an update there's no real update log anymore it's gone so basically now you have to figure it out for yourself every man and woman for yourself basically but uh, now i realized it mainly because this camera angle looks completely weird and strange and it just feels weird and different compared to how it looked before like it it's weird it just feels weird this camera angle is weird every other what's it called every other car it doesn't have a weird camera angle but the fbi car it does and that's the only reason i've been on the save team i've been on the other teams really it doesn't really have this weird camera angle or well, one of them one of the other teams does but it's not as weird as this but guys here it is bam interior able to go boom straight from outside third person mode to first person mode just like that just from zooming in you're just zooming in that's it you're just able to zoom in and i got i like this interior dude i really want to do an interior review man but i like how you're able to move from first person to third person or from third person to first person now I really like that, but I, I'm sick and tired of this weird camera angle. So we're switching teams to the NYSP and click. Okay, that little, did a little bit of a little skip there, a little hop skip. And then you have vehicles. So let's click on this and uh, click on FPIU 2020. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, my favorite car. We zoom out here and then we zoom, 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 zoom back in and we're in. Look at that third person to first person. This one kind of has a weird camera angle too. I don't know. Maybe it's because it's just so long. Maybe because the car is just so big. But I don't think it has. Let me see. Let me, let me just spawn this charger, right? Yeah, the charger. Yeah, this, this definitely doesn't have a weird camera angle. Like this was the camera angle I had before. But now you're able to go. Bam. Look at that. The Dodge logo. You got your computer. Able to go from first person to third person. Third person to first person. Boom. Easy breezy just like that also guys i should probably switch to the fire truck because that is one thing i haven't tried so this is gonna be quite interesting guys very very interesting oh my gosh bro every time i spawn in here bro i just love how it has it how it has an entire station i love the the finishness of it the finished 
finesse. I don't know how to say it. How do I say it? Like finesseness? No, that's that's a different word. But like the way it's able to be is how, how it just looks good. How it's completely done. How it leaves nothing open ended. But let me see. Let's go in first person. Oh, whoa. whoa. Okay. Well, wow. This is interesting. Very interesting to say the least. Okay, because my face is in the seat. That's why. Well, it looks like we do have a little bit of update capability in the future because I cannot see in first person mode. I can see all I see is completely black. Look, I'm out here. I scroll in black. Nothing. You can look to the side and you can see it. What about what if I go over here? Does it allow me to go into first person mode over here? I haven't actually tested that. Did it allow me to go into first person mode before? Oopsie daisy. Said whoopsie daisy. There we go. Did it allow me to go into first person mode before? I don't think it did. I really don't think it allowed me to go into first person mode before, but we're going to switch on over now to the civilian team. And guys, all you have to do is just go third person to first person. Easy breezy. And you already know what car I'm going to be using on the Civ team. We are going to be getting the Aventador Room. Vroom, 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 vroom. The nice gold Aventador, if I pick the right color. Oh, yeah. Here we are, guys. Baby. And then you zoom in. Lamborghini with the leather seats. Oh, yes, sir. If you guys want to see a Lamborghini review, leave it in the comment section down below. Also, let's see if we can get 100 likes. No, 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 150 likes for a Lamborghini review. Let's get 100 likes to see if we can get it. But if we get 150 likes, I'll do a Lamborghini view review interior, exterior, the whole shebang. So, guys, if you want to see a Lamborghini review, then let's get 150 likes. But now, guys, let's switch on over to did I forget anything else? Nope. Now it's time for our final team, which is the Mafia. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let's go here. BMW. No, let's test out the G wagon because G wagons are cool. G wagons are fun. G wagons are great for everyone. Bam. Okay, you just get this. Why does it look so small? On the outside, it looks big, but when you zoom in, it looks small. It looks smaller on the inside than it does on the outside because like in here it looks super compact right i'm not the only one that sees this right because it looks like a big suv on the outside i love the i love the what's it called the engine noise on this thing dude it's so awesome but it looks like a bigger suv on the outside versus the inside did he did he make this smaller what happened to this thing let me see am i in the back seat oh that's what happened that's what happened okay so now there's only four seats in this i'm assuming because before there were like eight but yeah guys this thing you used to be able to just fill it up with mafia members but i guess i guess you made it smaller dude i love this model man i love the the, the g-wagon but guys i'm gonna be going ahead and ending it off here if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like subscribe share with all your friends we're on the road to 2.5k if we haven't hit it already. And I'm going to be seeing you guys tomorrow or maybe even later today with a bonus video.